So I've been getting a lot of messages lately over the PewDiePie news. People are like, Ken, did you hear that PewDiePie is racist against Jews? And I'm like, he, he, he's racist against Jews? You mean anti-Semitic? And they're like, yeah, yeah, that's the same thing, right? I want to start off by saying, so you guys don't take anything I say out of context in the rest of this video, is that the, the jokes that he made in his videos, whether they're in context or not, they're, they're bad. So yeah, you guys have probably heard all about it, heard all the news, the freaking PewDiePie's anti-Semitic, or, well, no, probably, probably more like... Disney drops PewDiePie YouTube cancel show after anti-Semitic comments. And if you go, if you go look at the articles, that's what most of the articles are really focusing on. It's like uh, Disney drops PewDiePie. PewDiePie still earns millions after YouTube cancels his show. YouTube drops PewDiePie. You know, it's all this stuff. And then meanwhile, the Jewish people are still they're over here. Like, hello, we're still here. Don't forget about us. And actually, thinking about that, how like it's it's all bad. I don't I don't think I've ever seen or heard like anything about Jewish people on like TV or anything where they weren't the punchline. Uh, like for example, Family Guy had a Nazi, but I mean, he was defeated. So that makes it okay for them to even put that kind of stuff in the episode to begin with, right? Because of, because of context? Uh, I mean, I mean, not really. I, I don't think so. I mean, that's the whole argument over this thing between Felix's video and the articles is, is context. But, but the jokes are made, the jokes are bad in the story. And that's my stance on it. And, and that's the thing that bugs me most about this is how is how poorly everything was handled, how fast it blew up. It's, it's literally like, it's just it's just nightmare for everyone. People are mad at Felix, people are mad at the media, people are mad at Disney, people are mad at YouTube. People are mad at everyone. Ultimately, Disney can drop whoever they want. You know, it's whatever. They, it's, it's obvious that they want to distance themselves from anything anti-Semitic, especially given the, the, the company's founder's history which everyone keeps bringing up now. I mean, let's be honest, nobody actually knows what PewDiePie and Disney were really working on, and, and not to take away from the topic, but who who's really surprised that PewDiePie and Disney didn't, didn't, didn't work out? You know, it's like, it's like mixing like, like butter and sand. It's just, it's just, it's stupid. So old school media, you know, like, like words in a page works just like YouTube videos do. You get you a sensational clickbait title, you get you a good thumbnail, and, and you throw it up and then see who can get in there. Now on, on YouTube, after you click, you get clickbaited, you get to watch a video, but on, on, on their outlets, you, you have to, you have to read and, and who, who, who wants to do that? I mean, really who, who watches our YouTube videos actually goes and like, likes to read long articles. So now we have a whole bunch of people that just went and read a title. They don't even know what's going on. They don't even know what they're mad about. And everyone's just shitting all over each other's faces. My grandma's calling me like, why are you working with the Nazi? And meanwhile, I'm like, why? I mean, I mean, is, every, is everyone always this, this quick to like grab a pitchfork and go after someone because they're famous? <laughs> I mean, yeah, of course they are. We got to get them clicks, baby. And then, and then another thing that I kind of thought about is like everyone's like pointing fingers at like, oh, the media's taking things out of context, uh, clickbaity. But then like pe people on YouTube do the same thing. Like there's there's freaking channels that are about drama and calling people out. Uh, it's everywhere. There, there's even recently like a whole bunch of people of like white people saying the N word and then like trying to justify why they're saying it for views. So Felix mentions in his video that the Wall Street Journal came to Disney and YouTube before the, before the article was even published. The title of the article was probably something like, PewDiePie is a Nazi. He hates Jews. Click here to find out why. And apparently YouTube and Disney went, Oh God. Oh, oh my God. We gotta drop it. Pull the plug. Cancel everything. Jesus Christ. And then Wall Street Journal went, uh, Disney severs ties with YouTube star PewDiePie after anti-Semitic posts. Thank you very much. Whoa, we're getting all the clicks tonight, baby. Thank you. I mean, I mean, the the, the first one would have stirred up some trouble, but but that second title, if they just they just delivered on a silver platter. Wah, wah. Thank you. I mean, I'm not I'm not trying to make a joke of the whole situation, but it's just it's like it's it's really mind blowing to me. It's it's. I mean, is this how it really should have went down? I mean, a majority of people would have probably ignored, you know, the first article, honestly. And then the people that were like, deserved to be mad, they, they would probably have gotten like an actual apology. Felix would have probably still made a video, you know, replying and commenting on the article. Uh, and he would have probably still said he was sorry. I mean, I don't know that for sure, but I mean, in the past when they call him racist, you know, he reacted back to it and was like, look guys, I'm, you know, not racist, but I mean, it, it, it's, it's, it just, it just could have, it just could have been done better. But, but now you have a powerful title like Disney dropping Felix over being an insensitive idiot. 
it just really gets heads turning and, and, and everyone is now going to make an article about it. And but but like the whole the whole point of of that these people are offended and should be apologized to has been like it's, it's like almost overrun with just just the, the publicity of it. I mean, I mean, did Disney say, hey, man, this stuff is messed up. We, 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 we got to We got to make an apology or something or we're going to have to drop you or maybe we're going to drop you anyway. But it, I mean, it just had there had to be a better way than creating all this chaos. Just, just I mean, a, a, a way where the people that deserve an apology should have gotten one, but but now it's 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 just and that's the other part that really bugs me about the whole thing. It's it's I mean, there's a lot of people out there like, oh yeah, we got him, we got PewDiePie, baby, making anti-Semitic jokes, bam, shut down. But but it, but it's not just him that's been affected by this. There's there's there's, there's people people's like jobs have been lost over this. I mean, there there are pe real people, their, their lives have been directly, negatively, big time affected because of this. I mean, and that's, that's just, the, that's, that's really the worst part to me. I mean, I mean, no one gives a fuck about the Jewish people that work for Rebel Mode and whether or not they'll have the jobs tomorrow. No one, no one cares about all the other people that were working on these projects. You know, it's like, oh, hey, we got this great opportunity for you. We're gonna give you this job. Oh, hang on a second. Wait a minute. There's a media shit show. Everything's canceled. Sorry, good luck out there. I mean, I mean, I mean, nobody cares. We got, we got the big guy. Good job, everyone. We got him. Pat yourselves on the back. And I'm not, I'm not making, I'm not trying to say that he shouldn't, it shouldn't have happened. But I mean, it, it didn't have to happen like this. That's what I'm just saying. It, it just, there's so much wrong in the whole thing. The damage is done. Every, every, you know, it's blown up. Hopefully it doesn't keep going. I just think that we could have avoided a lot of the extra damage that was caused by this for people that they're they're not even at fault so good job internet breaking news pewdiepie's friend claims that pewdiepie is in fact a nazi be advised the following video on your screen is very disturbing and totally not taken out of context by any means viewer discretion is advised pewdiepie is a nazi he hates jews also tonight sub boxes will they ever work find out at 10 on clickbait news